when you see images of this destruction in the heart of the national capital and that too on Republic Day, when the entire nation was celebrating the 72nd Republic Day, your heart sinks, at least mine does. Because farmers had made a commitment to the Delhi police. Farm unions had assured the Delhi police there would be no violence. They claimed when they hold the tricolor in their hand because they too have sons in the army. They feel very proud of our republic and they will do the republic proud. They claimed there would be a peaceful protest, but the capital were anything but peaceful. And many in the Delhi police now argue this was all a part of a conspiracy. The route that was laid out for the protesters, that route was violated not once but at multiple locations and almost as per plan, farmers or protesters headed towards two symbols of the Indian state. One was the historic Red Fort, the other was India Gate. They succeeded in reaching the Red Fort, they failed to reach India Gate. Our Delhi Bureau, our best reporters on ground, they get you this report. Clashes. Chaos. Anarchy. A siege on the Red Fort on India's Republic Day. Never before seen images in the national capital as this tractor rally against three farm laws turned violent on Tuesday. As you can see, hundreds of boys have decided to break the barricades take and try and come outside. The first clashes were reported around 8 a.m. at the Singhu border. Kisan leaders and hundreds of thousands of farmers have decided to break the first line of barricades at the Singhu border and start moving out towards Delhi. You can see the uh, po uh, police arrangements had been, massive police arrangements had been made, but they have not tried to, they're not even trying to stop the farmers right now. The Protesters restless at Ghazipur and Tikri borders as well. जो रूट पुलिस ने दिया था वही फॉलो करेंगे कि कुछ और नहीं वो ही करेंगे जी जो पुलिस ने दिया है वो ही फॉलो करेंगे कंटेनर को पीछे पहले बैरिकेड को नाले में फेंका गया और अब जो है कंटेनर को सीधे सीधे उसको धक्का मार के हटाया जा रहा है तो इस समय ये जो तस्वीर है सीधे आप देख सकती है गाजीपुर बॉर्डर से कि किस तरीके से पूरी तरह से रास्ता कशी चल रही है टकराव चल रहा है इस वक्त But soon all hell broke loose as protesters began bursting through the barricades. Farmers here at the Ghazipur border are very determined. They do not want to relent. They are breaking the barricades, trying to enter the national capital. Protesters on tractors forced ahead of Akshar Dham, avoiding the planned U-turn and reaching the high-security ITO area via the Yamuna Bridge. नोएडा बोर्ड पर भारी तादाद में किसान यहां पहुंचे बैरिकेड के पास और पुलिस आंसू गैस के गोले लगातार छोड़ रही है आप देख सकते हैं कि उनको तितर बितर करने के लिए थोड़ी देर पहले भी किसानों ने नोएडा बोर्ड पर बैरिकेड तोड़ने की कोशिश की थी आप देख सकते हैं कि पूरा आंसू गैस के गोले छोड़े जा रहे हैं पुलिस जवानों को भगाने के लिए क्योंकि किसान नोएडा मोड़ पर जो बैरिकेडिंग है उसको तोड़ करके दिल्ली की तरफ घुसने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं With barricades smashed, the mob hurled stones, attacked outnumbered police personnel with sticks and fought a pitched battle. We have maintained a little distance from us and the farmers have left a lot of distance. You can see, there is another gas gun left by the police. The police is doing this every time. If anything is going to happen, if the farmers can go back from here, they can go back from here. Farmers were also seen driving tractors dangerously and even trying to run over police personnel. Another tractor comes in, they are using tractors at tanks right now, ramming everything uh, on their way, all right. 
A large mob then drove to the Red Fort complex, laying siege to the monument and hoisting the Nishan Sahib, a flag sacred to Sikhs, at the Red Fort, on the ramparts used for Prime Minister's August 15th speech. कि लाल किले पर पुलिस और प्रशासन की भारी तैनाती इस वक्त की गई है लेकिन किसानों की संख्या यहां पर काफी ज्यादा दिखाई पड़ रही है और आप देख रहे हैं कि यहां उन्होंने अपना झंडा भी फहरा दिया है लेटर इन द इवनिंग एज प्रोटेस्टर्स रिट्रीटेड देयर वाज फ्रेश केयोस इन नांगलोई एज अ मैसिव कंटेनर कैरियर वाज ओवरटर्न्ड बाय एजिटेटर्स द सिचुएशन रिमेंस टेंस योर रिपोर्ट इंडिया टुडे there was violence and there were those who tried to give intellectual cover fire to that violence and the question remains were the delhi police naive was the ministry of home affairs naive were they not aware this would happen or was there so much pressure mounted by vested interest to ensure that violence would be there and action would not be taken what happened at the historic red fort the entire nation is proud of the red fort and the fact that the prime minister since 1947 has been giving independence day uh, commentary uh, independence day speeches from the ramparts of the red fort addressing the nation from the ramparts of the red fort that place as many say was desecrated today why that question and take a look at what happened on ground the most defining image of the large scale clashes and chaos that shamed india on 72nd republic day the podium on the ramparts of red fort where the prime minister unfurls the tricolor every year on august 15th but on tuesday it was completely taken over by an unruly mob of vandals posing as farmers the red fort was overrun by unruly mob that entered the monumental complex through its public entrance moments later a swarm of protesters had taken over the red fort gallery shouting slogans brandishing swords trying to unfurl the saffron nishan sahib where the national flag flutters it seemed like nothing was sacred for the mob they went a step ahead to desecrate the red fort by climbing on its dome the confrontation with the police lasted for hours सुरक्षा बल वहां पर ऊपर चढ़ रहे हैं देखिए देखिए मैं दिखाना चाहूंगी यहाँ पर ये बहुत अहम है अगर किसानों ने चढ़ के तिरंग अपना निशान साहब और किसानों का झंडा लगाया तो यहाँ पर पुलिस बल ऊपर चढ़ रहे हैं उस झंडे को उतारने के लिए और नीचे से जोर से हुटिंग हो रही है कि नहीं 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 आप नहीं उतार सकते वो सुरक्षा बल जैसे तैसे ऊपर चढ़ने की कोशिश कर रहा है लेकिन देखिए तालियों के साथ अब यहाँ पर एक कॉम्पिटिशन वाली भावना आ गई है हमने लगाया आप उतार कर दिखा दीजिए है हिम्मत तो उतारिए कुछ इस तरह की फीलिंग यहाँ पर है देखिए हुटिंग लगातार यहाँ पर हो रही है अ ग्रुप ऑफ पुलिसमैन ट्राइड बट कुड नॉट रिमूव द निशान साहिब the mob laid siege to the historic 17th century structure for hours in a monumental show of anarchy and lawlessness bureau report india today i now want to show you what's the latest where we are at the income tax office so you can look around me there is massive deployment of the delhi police even at this point of time and now there is a lot of patrolling that's happening on motorcycles police also finally getting their first meal of the day uh, and uh, you know we will go closer to the police and see what 
they are eating remember they have been deployed since 4 in the morning but this is the first meal that the delhi police are getting to eat today such has been the hectic activity uh, a hectic activity here there is tense calm uh, all along this area while the protesters are no longer here uh, but the barricades remain and four layers of barricades so this shattered bus is one layer behind this another layer of barricades then concrete barricades then another layer of buses to ensure that the farmers i mean that was the that was the apprehension one group succeeded in reaching red fort just a couple of kilometers down the road from here the other group wanted to reach india gate and because of these barricades that group did not succeed we are told 85 policemen are injured and i want to cut across to india today's rahul shrivastava national affairs editor for the latest on the story joining me on the broadcast is also savit malik a, a farmer leader dr ajay uh, kumar is spokesperson of the congress party gopal krishna agrawal is spokesperson for the bharatiya janata party and with me is dr vikram singh former director general of the uttar pradesh police but rahul if i may come to you first the latest on ground at this point of time have all the pockets of resistance if i may have they been cleared in the national capital are farmers all out with tractors back uh, in their designated spot outside the borders or is there still a situation prevailing somewhere in the national capital i can say is that a hunt is on you see there are several points at which there were point of uh, configuration between the police and uh, the protesters uh, there were several points at which after the friction uh, the protesters dispersed but so uh, so busy was the police in ensuring uh, that they do not enter further into the capital that certain amount of search is required whether all of them are out say for example at ito where you are standing together in the evening after the people went away they were chased away they left after the police said that they will there is an imminent crackdown and the police can't tolerate the presence at the presence at such a busy intersection is untenable they dispersed but delhi is a very different kind of city compared to bombay it's a large city with various roads leading to in all directions and that is why police sources are saying a thorough combing operation is on that all the protesters and the tractors are back out of delhi but a uh, clear and present imminent danger remains and uh, what sources are also saying that there is also uh, an attempt by some of the protesters that they may find local shelter so the local the police is uh, trying to ensure that if some people are finding local shelter and they may reemerge to protest or lay siege somewhere in the capital whether they can be checked but i think it's a very hard task given the kind of atmosphere that pre uh, prevailed the number of people which had entered rahul, rahul stay with me lay siege no no in fact now, now, is, the time, are, now is the time now is the time let's call a spade taken. a spade yes rahul the next round is lay siege to the parliament ahead of yes. the budget session so you know the government i'm sure is aware of this and will the government take effective measures or will the government and the delhi police be caught napping once again or if not caught napping at least caught off guard when the when the first flush actually came in but let me pose this question to savit malik a uh, farmer leader uh, savit malik ji bahut aapko garv hai bahut garv hai जो आज हुआ राजधानी दिल्ली की सड़कों पर जो हुआ लाल किले पर जो हुआ आईटीओ पर गर्व है किसान नेताओं को मैं इसकी कठोर शब्दों में निंदा करता हूं और मैं आपको बताना चाहता हूं कि हमारा जो आंदोलन था वो सही तरीके से चल रहा था लेकिन कुछ बाहरी लोग इसमें घुसे जिन्होंने इसको खराब करने की कोशिश की ताकि हमारा आंदोलन खराब हो जाए लेकिन उन लोगों को चिन्हित कर लिया गया है और आपको पता होगा दीप सिद्धू जिसने वो झंडा फहराया है वो बीजेपी का कार्यकर्ता है माननीय प्रधानमंत्री जी के साथ उसकी फोटो लगी हुई है तो हम सीधा सीधा आरोप लगाते हैं ये जो किया गया है ये हमारे आंदोलन के खिलाफ एक साजिश है ये षडयंत्र के तहत किया गया है किसानों का जो भी आंदोलन था वो बताए हुए रूट पर हुआ और पुलिस के साथ मिलकर हुआ दिल्ली पुलिस और हमारे वॉलेंटियर ने मिलकर इसको सही तरीके से निकाला है लेकिन ये लोग कहां से आ गए इन्होंने जो हमारे आंदोलन को खराब करना चाहते हैं अरे 
अरे आप लोग कल तक तो बड़ी गारंटी ले रहे थे कि ये किसान नेताओं की गारंटी है कुछ गलत नहीं होगा आपके वॉलेंटियर थे अब आप सारा सारा दोषारोपण सरकार पर कर रहे हैं लेकिन चलिए चलिए आपने आप कह रहे हैं बीजेपी के कार्यकर्ता है गोपाल कृष्ण अग्रवाल गोपाल कृष्ण अग्रवाल उत्तर दीजिए उत्तर दीजिए आरोप यह लग रहा है कि जिन लोगों ने लाल किले पर ये जो गैर कानूनी कृत है उसको किया वो भारतीय जनता पार्टी के कार्यकर्ता या भारतीय जनता पार्टी से संबंधित लोग हैं देखिए बेशर्मी की भी हद होती है अन्नदाता अन्नदाता करते उसको अन्नदाता अन्नदाता करते हुए सारे देश की सिंपैथी बटोर रहे थे और जब सरकार और पुलिस इन्हें बता रही थी कि आपके आंदोलन आपके हाथ में इसे निकला हुआ है और अराजक तत्व और विदेशी ताकतें उसके अंदर घुस के उसको डीरेल कर रही है और हिंसा की गतिविधियों को अंजाम देने का पूरा उनका प्लान है छब्बीस जनवरी को और तब आप मान नहीं रहे थे और अब शर्म नहीं आ रही आपको शर्म आनी चाहिए आपको कि गणतंत्र दिवस के दिन अरे ये ये जो देशभक्ति का चमका ओढ़े बैठे हो ना एक एक करके एक एक करके देखिए आप माने ना माने आप माने ना माने जिसकी भी गलती है भारत का गणतंत्र भारत का गणतंत्र आज शर्मसार हुआ है और और लेट मी लेट मी लेट मी गेट लेट मी गेट डॉक्टर विक्रम सिंह लेट मी गेट फॉर्मर विक्रम सिंह फॉर्मर डीजीपी अरे सबित मलिक जी सबित मलिक जी सबित मलिक जी सुनिए सुनिए आप लोग कल तक गारंटी ले रहे थे कि कुछ अराजक तत्व नहीं आ पाएंगे आप कल तक गारंटी ले रहे थे कि किसानों को तिरंगे पर सम्मान है आप कल तक गारंटी दे रहे थे कि एक किसान का बेटा हल चलाता है तो एक बेटा फौज में है और तिरंगे का सम्मान होगा ये सम्मान हुआ तिरंगे का हमारे देश में बट मिस्टर विक्रम सिंह वेदर फार्मर यूनियन फार्मर यूनियन लीडर से फार्मर यूनियन लीडर से दैट सबडी एसोसिएटेड विद बीजेपी इज इन्वॉल्व लेगा and the their leaders and decides to go and desecrate the national flag people should have known both the police and also the farmer leaders and the farmers also a shame has been committed a despicable our honor and the tricolor are non negotiable and there can be no question anybody who desecrates the tricolor anybody who desecrates the 26th the republic day needs to be taken to task and all those have been who have been willing accessories to this crime need to answer the nation why and under what circumstances you allowed this to happen you allowed if I even i presume allowed the grass okay. to grow underneath your feet and drastic action needs to be taken both police and administrative against those who were silent spectators or who promoted this kind of violence and desecration of the national flag i want you to wear both your hats on the broadcast today <clears throat> one as a former police officer the other as a political leader as someone who represents a, a, a major opposition party in our country the congress party in your view is there merit in the government saying that this was pre planned this was orchestrated farmer protests were only a facade it was actually anti social elements who had infiltrated and this was an aim and the government saying that several in the opposition gave intellectual cover fire to such anti national activity sir look uh, gorup the uh, there a couple of things uh, all the previous speaker have spoken and uh, what's happened is definitely uh, uh, condemnable despicable uh, awful there's no debate on that what's uh, the other points uh, across has been uh, something which is uh, which is absolutely shocking so there and no protest any form of protest which leads uh, leads to this kind of any kind of violence uh, especially in a in a democratic process uh, in democratic countries uh, not only should be condemned but uh, Uh, i think uh, we all uh, on, uh, who are part of the political uh, class uh, will be unanimous in this view so there's no debate on that that what's happened is wrong uh, the infiltration by these kind of elements uh, whether 
who are there on all is a matter of investigation but the fact is that they have brought on a, they have made the whole peaceful 60 days or uh, 175 farmers have died uh, and after all that they have definitely uh, you know illegitimized the process uh, the protest to a large extent i mean they have definitely damaged the protest to a large extent. no but the question now remains the, the question remains was was an attempt made to mislead you know why protest only on the republic day was it an attempt to shame our republic on the 72nd republic day savit malik ji iska uttar to kisan netaon ko dene ki avashyakta hai jo aaj hi ke din gartantra divas ke hi din gartantra parade ek kisan parade nikalna chahte the पहला प्रश्न आज ही का दिन क्यों दूसरा प्रश्न लाल किले पर ही हिंसा नहीं हुई हिंसा तो कई और जगह पर हुई क्या एक व्यक्ति हर जगह पर था या फिर हिंसा किसानों की आड़ में किसानों की आड़ में यह देश को बदनाम करने की एक सोची समझी सुनियोजित साजिश थी गौरव जी हम पहले दिन से कह रहे हैं जब से हमारा आंदोलन चल रहा है सरकार उसको कहीं ना कहीं किसी ना किसी रूप में कमजोर करना चाहती है ये हमने सबूत दिया है कि एक आदमी जो वहां चढ़ा था वो बीजेपी का था तो जितने आदमी थे जो जो गड़बड़ कर रहे थे वो सब इनके आदमी थे ये हम गारंटी से कह सकते हैं हमारे आदमी किसान नहीं नहीं और दिल्ली आपकी कोई जिम्मेदारी नहीं थी तो जो आपकी दिल्ली पुलिस के साथ आठ राउंड की बातचीत हुई वो सब दिखावा छलावा था कि आप जो सैतीस उस पर आपने हस्ताक्षर किए तो क्या बीजेपी क्या बीजेपी की सरकार आपको हर अलग रास्ते पर लेकर गई थी गौरव जी दिल्ली पुलिस के तोड़े गए जो दिल्ली पुलिस के बैरियर तोड़े गए जो बैरियर को उठा के नालों में डाला गया वो लोग वही थे जो झटका फैला रहे थे उनको चिन्हित करो उनको चिन्हित करो ये सरकार का क्या काम है ये गोपाल जी कह रहे हैं इनसे ये सरकार का क्या काम है अरे आपके बंद में वहां जाकर झंडा गिरा रहे उनको ये भी नहीं पता किस कलर का झंडा होता है आप लोगों के लो, आ, आप आंदोलन कमजोर करना चाहते हैं आप किसानों के आंदोलन से घबराए हुए हैं डरे हुए हैं कमजोर करना चाहते हैं गौरव जी इनके आप लोग इनका तो हद हो गई कि या अपनी गलतियों की जिम्मेदारी भी नहीं लेना चाहते सारा प्रधानमंत्री लेकिन यहाँ जिम्मेदारी अरे गोपाल जी यहाँ जिम्मेदारी पर बनती है दो लोगों की एक दिल्ली पुलिस की और एक भारत सरकार की और दोनों अपनी जिम्मेदारी नहीं तो गौरव क्या विफल रहे हैं इस प्रश्न का इस प्रश्न का उत्तर तो आप ही बताना पड़ेगा इतनी इतनी बड़ी संख्या में पुलिस के होने के बावजूद कैसे लाल किले पर चढ़ गई है उपद्रवी कैसे उन्होंने इतने बैरिके तोड़े हो रहे थे अगर ये तो सर पुलिस का अच्छा है पुलिस ने अपना वो संवेदनशीलता दिखाई और पुलिस अगर संवेदनशीलता नहीं दिखाती और इतना रेस्ट्रेंट नहीं दिखाती तो क्या पुलिस के पास पावर नहीं है क्या पुलिस तो अगर एग्रेसिव हो जाती और इनके हिंसा के जवाब को बल से प्रयोग से देती तो कितना आज खून खराब हो जाएगा आज जा, माल का हानि हुई है बसों की हानि हुई है बाकी चीजों की हानि हुई है लेकिन जान की हानि केवल एक व्यक्ति की हुई है वह भी उसकी अपनी गलती से और अगर पुलिस हिंसा लेकिन बल प्रयोग गोपाल अग्रवाल जी आप इस प्रश्न का उत्तर दीजिए किसान आंदोलनकारी ये कह रहे हैं कि जो व्यक्ति लाल किले पर चढ़ा था वो व्यक्ति भारतीय जनता पार्टी के एक सांसद के साथ और प्रधानमंत्री के साथ तस्वीर खिंचा रहा था पहले तो ये तो बीजेपी को इस पर सफाई देनी है कि कौन है ये व्यक्ति क्या है इसका एसोसिएशन भारतीय जनता पार्टी के साथ पहली बात दूसरी बात अगर मालूम था इस तरह की चीज होने वाली है तो ऐसे लोगों को चिन्हित करके उनके खिलाफ कड़ी कानूनी कार्रवाई क्यों नहीं की गई क्या डरती है सरकार कर, कड़ी कानूनी कार्रवाई करने से नई प्रजातंत्र में आप ही यहाँ पे चिल्ला चिल्ला के सब लोग ये किसान लोग के जो अन्नदाता 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 हमारे अन्नदाता शांतिपूर्ण आंदोलन कर रहे हैं सरकार इनको नहीं करने दे रही इस तरह की जो नरेशन और इस तरह की बात जो थी अगर प्रजातंत्र में इस अधिकार को कोई रोक देते जा प्रजातंत्र में अरे आप मुझे जब मैंने आपको बोलने दिया फिर ये बीच में बोल रहे इंटेलिजेंसिफिक इंटेलिजेंस दैट 
anti social elements anti national elements they will try to infiltrate he spoke of some 308 pakistani social media uh, handles that had gotten activated if all this information was there rahul shivastav why was action not taken against those who were going to or who were you know going to violate uh, peace in this area gorod there was a problem there was a problem uh, with the police that the orders today were restrained uh, there was supposed to be no excessive use primarily because of the long pact that the farm union leaders had signed with the delhi police on what exactly are going to be the contours of the tractor rally now the tractor rally was agreed only because leaders agreed to a certain degree of restraint on the size of the rallies and the police now after that whatever has transpired there is a definite breach of trust which has happened every rally gorov which is taken out into the capital needs a permission and an agreement between the organizers who are supposed to be accountable but please show me one okay. single farmer leader who had negotiated and brokered a deal with the police who was monitoring and was at the borders visibly taking the lead out as far as the protests are concerned one if they are saying that miscreants had entered this is exactly what the government was telling them the government was telling them as late as the last meeting with the beast minister the farm union mr tomar the agriculture minister said ki is andolan ki aatma pradushit ho chuki hai apavitra ho chuki hai means certain elements have entered and dr ajay kumar Now, that's a very pertinent point, point to raise there rahul shivastav the give me 30 seconds give me 30 seconds the people have entered one point i'd like to yes. make is that can they negotiate with the government any further no no you know the point i want to raise with dr ajay kumar is that did these farm leaders give intellectual uh, cover fire and did in elements in our society that, uh, give intellectual uh, cover fire to do this to parade. this was this was this always the design dr ajay kumar it's not about a political pa a political party b c or d this is about a republic being shamed on republic day and was this was this ultimately the aim of those who perhaps do not even believe in democracy that on republic day we will shame the republic of india and they've succeeded dr ajay kumar look uh, got the first question like rahul correctly said the basic issue was uh, did we follow the procedure of giving permission to x y z were those guarantees given taken in writing from the people who are organizing the protest like any uh, any uh, police officer with minimum knowledge will say that whenever you have a procession or a protest or any march or then you need a certain conditions in which the licenses are issued so those who are not followed or not i don't know i have not privy to it but if it's not followed then that's it's absolutely insane second issue is if the government knew so much that there was a chance of uh, uh, mischievous elements getting in then why was the permission given uh, so that beats me you know totally uh, if the protest if the government knew that there will be miscreants coming in its republic day and uh, the handlers from pakistan and other countries and uh, anti india's uh, elements are definitely have infiltrated then the worst thing you could have done was to give permission so uh, and that's why delhi police got overwhelmed okay. also and that's why you saw this is from a law and order perspective now the, the mr Vikram perspective Singh, delhi police got Gora, overwhelmed Gora. that's that's rather poor commentary that's rather poor commentary okay rahul shrivastav quickly and then mr vikram singh yes rahul Rahul, one quick point which I would like to make is that why the permission was given. Gorov, remember, I am now certain, and I think if the government also knew, and the assessment, if the government hadn't done given a permission, there was the idea perhaps was to create a worse flare-up at the borders where larger numbers were present. This is a much lesser a damage. The fact remains. that this also tells the former leaders that the idea was never uh, repealing of the bill the idea is there are 1 billion discontent in this country but nobody goes to the red fort to hoist take off the national tricolor and hoist the flag first time since 1947 when the union jack was brought down the indian flag has been ashamed shamed at that place i think the farmers should introspect 
the point to be made here is not everybody wants to go more to more than the farmers the, the, the farmer leaders and those who are giving intellectual to to cover fire red red to, to this entire river. agitation throughout in the past 60 days they need to introspect is any is any agitation more important than than the republic no mr vikram singh no gopal agrawal i'm sorry it's the government the government really needs to come clean the government cannot say no, they no, were scared of criticism Gaurav, they have been Gaurav, elected to uphold the law the of the land to they Police haven't been elected to let farmers. let interest groups run right in the national capital sir howsoever high one may be law has to be above that person whether it's annadata or any data law is supreme and law was not supreme so vikram today, singh call in the national capital today sir call them a uh, 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 violent don't Are call sir, them sir sarkar hai what do you mean call them terrorists take action take action against Haan, those so, who are guilty what so, do you mean so call them terrorists sir you want take action take legal process. action that you can you prove in a court of law of the thing rule of law has to be supreme certain things no because of certain things you expect that the government should not allow democratic processes what what is the uh, this farmers sir, if, and if you haven't i am they sorry gopal agrawal what i am sorry no, but, if you haven't understood the difference between democratic process and anarchy then i'm sorry our country is heading for really bad times mr vikram singh no, our country no, about to be heading for is, major trouble in the times to come like to, if i, if, like I, to, I am I'm sorry this is not democratic the, process uh, Rah- this is uh, not, mr vikram singh Mr Vikram Singh the police sir, has a duty to cover high anyone may be the law has to be above that person the stripped of virgin the fact of the matter Mr. is gorav ji that the police have a job to perform is, robust policing no on the ground area domination arrest of the wanted and the accused and also sanitization of the area preventive arrest are a must i am sorry to say but all this did not happen i agree that the police was in a catch 22 situation and damned if you do and damned if you don't but there is certain things that the police should not have faulted upon and the first was preventive arrest the second was sanitization and then proper police presence in every nook and corner i am given to understand by your uh, footnotes that 15 additional companies of paramilitary they seem to be too little i would strongly recommend the position of 100 paramilitary companies under these situations which i have used and under these circumstances nothing less than 100 additional companies would meet the requirement i do hope that the facial recognition software the other technologies that are there to identify the hoodlums and the ruffians they are given a message for a lifetime because the sanctity of the public day and the tricolor are non negotiable to say the least and anybody who fools around with that needs oh, to be absolutely. given a lesson of a lifetime first the opposition without fear of favor arrested. without fear of favor go after those who were involved विदाउट फेयर ऑफ फेवर अरे सर सरकार को चुना जाता है शासन के लिए सरकार को इसलिए नहीं चुना जाता कि वो बोले अरे वो चिन्हित है वो चिन्हित है वो चिन्हित है लेकिन कार्रवाई नहीं हुई ये तो पहली बात लेकिन ऑपोजिशन डॉक्टर अजय कुमार जब बीजेपी से ऑपोजिशन इज माउंटिंग सो मच प्रेशर दिन इज माउंटिंग सो मच प्रेशर दैट डेमोक्रेटिक प्रोसेस इज नॉट बींग फॉलोड दैट इज वाई देवर अनेबल टू टेक एक्शन अगेंस्ट दो मे इवन है Doctor. No, look, Gaurav. Mm-hmm. I don't think. Look, the the job of any opposition or Today any political party. Today also you see what Rahul Gandhi is saying. Gopal sir, let me. Gopal Agarwal sir, I'll complete and then you do it. Look, the Bharatiya Janata Party, when when we were in the government, has been party to so many agitations, and they did it. Uh, some of them did it violently. That's a different issue. So most of it was peaceful. So whenever you, so when we are in the opposition. or any other government or any group of people who are who are against the farm law who are against land acquisition if it's peaceful i don't think anybody has got an issue because that is the job of the of the people and that's democracy as long as you're peaceful now imagine a situation yes. in an alternative universe got up for a second if the tractor rally had happened absolutely peacefully right without any violence at all all of us on the tv channel would have said that the andadatas have presented the ultimate respect to the union to the country and the constitution if it was peaceful so the fact is that it's not sir had the... it been peaceful we would have said jai jawan jai jawan exactly. at the red sir. fort jai jawan at rajpath and jai kisan at the rally 
यू नो जय जवान जय किसान लेकिन आप जय जवान तो कर सकते हैं लेकिन आप जय किसान कैसे बोलेंगे जब इस तरह का उपद्रव हम देखेंगे राजधानी दिल्ली की सड़कों पर एक भी गौर देखना है सरकार किसानों ये जो किसानों का आंदोलन है इसके लीडर्स का क्या इंटेंशन है ओके लेट डॉक्टर अजय कुमार कंप्लीट लेट डॉक्टर अजय कुमार कंप्लीट माय अपॉलॉजीज़ फॉर इंटरप्टिंग डॉक्टर अजय कुमार प्लीज कंप्लीट सर सर आंदोलन करिए उपद्रव नहीं आंदोलन जरूर कीजिए शांतिपूर्वक होना चाहिए Yes, Dr. Jay Kumar. My apologies. Yes, go on, Dr. Jay Kumar. Yes, please. My question, my question, my question. Yeah, other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. My question is, my other ones are already taken. Yeah, purpose. The fact is that it was writers. The fact is that all the people who took guarantee, and that's what uh, is unfortunate. And I, I totally get to the uh, the difficulty of the policemen. Eighty people have been injured, and I think a lot of lot of yes. harm has been caused. Or a very very legitimate protest has been has been damaged to us. And even my uh, the my colleagues from the farm movement and uh, and all other people on this panel will agree that. This kind of this action itself has damaged uh, the righteousness of the protest to a large extent. I mean, irrespective of whatever be it, whatever has been the uh, whatever okay. will be the final outcome. Okay. नो द फैक्ट में सबित मलिक जी सबित मलिक जी ये जो आंदोलन है ये जो आंदोलन है अगर ये शांति ओके ओके गोपाल गोपाल अग्रवाल वांट्स टू रिस्पॉन्ड जी 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 ओके गोपाल अग्रवाल प्लीज रिस्पॉन्ड सर we should understand what was the issue when the government was clearly ready to accept and change the laws and uh, suspend it then still the uh, farmers or uh, were trying to do this act and this uh, uh, sir that debate we've already had sir that debate we've been having for 60 days sir today today the government today the bjp needs to respond to inaction inadequate action no, no, and it is, was it, it poor intelligence or poor implementation of action on that intelligence sir restraint uh, uh, restraint is seen as weakness a a restraint is weakness in case the law of the land is violated lekin no you have to understand that the sir, government has uh, every sentiment for the farmers and the people of the country it is not that just use uh, Okay. Okay. मलिक जी आप कह रहे हैं कि आपको आंदोलन की स्वतंत्रता है इसमें दो राय नहीं इसमें दो राय नहीं कि अन्नदाता को किसान को आंदोलन की स्वतंत्रता है लेकिन उपद्रव की स्वतंत्रता नहीं है नहीं सर सर नहीं 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 अन्नदाता है अन्नदाता है अन्नदाता है अन्नदाता है नहीं सम्मान कृषक को कृषक के लिए कृषक के लिए सम्मान है सर कृषक के लिए सम्मान है नहीं जिनको मेहनत कर रहे पैसा मिल रहा है ये आपकी ये क्या है यही सोच है यही तो नरेशन के कारण है सर यूएस पे जो है यूएस फ्रीडम एग्रीकल्चर इनकम पे टैक्स सर यूएस फ्रीडम ऑफ चॉइस सब्सिडी उनको मिलती है एमएसपी पे उनका मार्केटिंग आता है दैट्स एन अदर डिबेट वी विल हैव द डिबेट किस बात के लिए चुप हो नहीं नहीं लेकिन मलिक साहब अरे आज 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 तो आपको भी जो किसान नेता हैं जो अब तक इतना दावा कर रहे थे कि तिरंगे पर गर्व है और हमें जवानों पर गर्व है आज तो आपने उन जवानों के भी नाक को कितना नीचे कर दिया उनका सम्मान कितना नीचे कर दिया इन उपद्रवियों ने आंदोलन की स्वतंत्रता है कानून तोड़ने की नहीं है जिम्मेदारी लेने के बजाय सरकार अरे नेताओं गोपाल जी गोपाल जी सरकार की जिम्मेदारी है दोषियों को चिन्हित करे पकड़े और कड़ी कार्रवाई करे आप कड़ी कार्रवाई कीजिए और फिर अगर उस पर उपद्रव होता है तब हम देखेंगे लेकिन अरे नहीं नहीं अरे सरकार टीवी चैनल पर बैठ के थोड़ी विलाप कर सकती है सरकार को कार्रवाई करने की आवश्यकता है विपक्ष विलाप करे तो समझ आता है सरकार कैसे विलाप कर सकती है आपके पास तो राष्ट्र की शक्ति आपके पास है अच्छा तो वो फोर्स तो आपके क्या सर जनता ने आपको चुनकर भेजा है आप निर्णय कीजिए 
बिल्कुल ये तो प्रश्न यहाँ ये होता है ये तो प्रश्न ये होता है कि अगर आपको शासन नहीं आता तो फिर इसका विकल्प क्या क्या हो सकता है लेकिन नहीं नहीं देखिए मलिक साहब कांग्रेस ने किया मलिक साहब कांग्रेस ने किया नियत मलिक साहब जिस तरह मारा मलिक साहब किसानों को किसान किसानों को उपद्रव की अनुमति नहीं है ये बात आप मानते हैं किसान मैं मानता हूँ इसकी कठोर निंदा क्या, करता हूँ किसानों ने उपद्रव नहीं किया है ये बीजेपी के लोग थे केवल निंदा नहीं ये बीजेपी के लोग चिन्हित 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 कीजिए चिन्हित कीजिए और कड़ी कार्रवाई होनी चाहिए कड़ी कार्रवाई होनी चाहिए बीजेपी को कार्यकर्ता माननीय प्रधानमंत्री जी अरे के साथ एक दिन वो तो दिल्ली पुलिस पर निर्भर करता है कि सबूत है कि नहीं अब अब ये अब किसान नेता निर्धारित करेंगे कौन दोषी है कौन नहीं अब तो दिल्ली पुलिस को कार्रवाई करनी ही चाहिए लेकिन राहुल श्रीवास्तव द थ्रेट इज एंड देर इज क्लियर एंड प्रेजेंट डेंजर राहुल श्रीवास्तव राहुल नहीं सर आप लोगों ने आप किस क्या किसान नेताओं ने और ये प्रश्न तो किसान नेताओं को देना चाहिए कि क्या किसान नेताओं ने झूठा आश्वासन दिया प्रशासन को देश को और क्या देश का नाम मिट्टी में मिलाया इस तरह के किसान नेताओं ने जिन्होंने सैतीस सैतीस चीजों पर हस्ताक्षर किया और सैतीस चीजों का उल्लंघन हुआ है नहीं लेकिन राहुल श्रीवास्तव राहुल श्रीवास्तव देर स्टिल इज क्लियर एंड प्रेजेंट डेंजर देर स्टिल इज क्लियर एंड प्रेजेंट डेंजर राहुल श्रीवास्तव बिकॉज नाउ द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ दिस गेम प्लान विच विल अनफोल्ड इज टारगेट द पार्लियामेंट इन द बजट सेशन एंड द गवर्नमेंट बेटर वेकअप Yes, God of the government definitely needs to wake up. Primarily because I think there have been too many slip-ups. One, this whole issue of the farm union leaders needs to be discussed threadbare. An assessment has to be done because I don't think these farm leaders have any control or they do true representation of of who they allege to be. They don't really have any control or have any sense of connect with them. Today they totally were missing. Second is the government. I think the government action. was lagged in terms of sharpness it required it also gives rise to perhaps the, uh, the to the fact that was it so that by letting this happen by knowing something like this is going to happen perhaps the uh, the pixel moments which have gone out among the public does discredit the farm unions and the farmers protest but gora uh, this farm leader gentleman who is on the show says that the bjp leaders were posing pictures with a man who hoisted the flag so the bjp is accountable similarly these farm leaders were taking guarantee of these very men who run right and amok today they have to take the guarantee by yes. the same virtue that if the prime minister amit shah whose pictures are seen he is alleging with the man who hoisted the flag at the same po- at a poll at the uh, right port similarly they have to take accountability because their credibility is gone today can Absolutely. they negotiate further on behalf of the farmers with the government the answer is zero okay i will let that be the last word on the show because i don't want to end this very beautiful day as the country celebrates the 72nd republic day on a sad note or on a note that the red fort was desecrated you know there are some images which are so disturbing today which actually show how policemen were literally running for cover and the farmers were chasing them some of these pictures are extremely disturbing and i hope every one of that perpetrator is identified and the strictest possible action as per the law of the land is taken against those who broke the law hi everyone preeti choudhury here hope you like this video for latest news and analysis Like and subscribe to the India Today YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated. Thank you for watching.